anybody dies, I mean, it's always a tragedy, and regardless of what they're killed about. Uh, and people really shouldn't riot. Uh, Mr. Rodney King himself was saying that, basically, that the rioting didn't make sense, because it doesn't. People, riots, what happens in a riot, and what the word riot really means is that there's chaos, harmful chaos. And in harmful chaos, lots of people get hurt who should not be hurt. So people shouldn't, shouldn't ever participate in a riot, regardless of the circumstances, for that particular reason. It's a logical reason. Too many people get harmed who should not be harmed. People's stores were burned. Many stores. Kind of reminds me, kind of reminds me of Detroit. Some of those places, even after 1968, have never to this day been repaired. Absolutely, and I understand right there in Los Angeles during the time of the Rodney King riots that there was a uh, car repair shop, I believe it was, mm -hmm. that had been there for years, run by a black person. And the black person was actually standing there in the street saying, why are you burning me? Why are you burning my place down? You all know me here. I mean, I've been here for years. The people all through the neighborhood know me. I've been here for like forever, and now you've put me out of business. And the people just kind of stood around just saying nothing because of the frenzy that happens when there's a riot. All kinds of things happen during a riot. People just jump up and do things with no rhyme or reason at all. That's what riot means. It means unthinking, just rampaging. Just knocking over things, setting things afire, breaking things, and then later on thinking about it. So some people's minds are in a state of rioting almost every day. Yes. Because they do non-constructive things. They think, you know, they don't think about things. They just, just mindlessly go about just bumping into things, knocking things over, stepping on people cursing people, getting on the bus and just start something just to break the silence.